guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Morena Gal, and today it's kind of exciting. A lot, like a lot of you guys commented on my last video and the one before that, both on Blackpink. The majority of the people who commented on those videos said, sure thing, sure, because I asked for recommendations. Everybody was like, sure thing. It was crazy. I was like, wow, is it really that good? First and foremost, Miguel, he's an amazing, phenomenal, Afro-Latino, like he's such an amazing singer, like oh my god. Like when I was in middle school, y'all, I feel like that's aging me. Yeah, like that song came out when I was in middle school. When I was in middle school, everybody who thought they could sing would sing that song. So it would be like, oh, you think you can sing? Then sing Sure Thing by Miguel. Let's see if you can really sing. Like it was like the test. I don't know, I have a lot of love for this song, so hopefully. It lives up to my expectations, I suppose, but I'm not going to be like too hard on them because Sure Thing is such like a beautiful, intricate, sensual song, but playful at the same time. So let's see how Blackpink does. Also, I do want to add, do you guys like my hair? I've never had blue hair before. I think it is gorgeous. This is actually for my hair company, and even more so than just being for my hair company, I bleached this hair and dyed it myself, and I think it turned out really good. Like, do you guys think it? I think it turned out really well. Like, I didn't think it was gonna turn out this well, so yeah, I'm just excited about it. It's not like an in-your-face blue. It's like a muted blue turquoise color, and I was actually inspired by Deku from Midoriya, from My um, Hero Academia, so I never thought in a million years I would be inspired by an anime character. Yeah. My Hero Academia is such a good show. If you have not subscribed already, go ahead and subscribe to your girl. Um, yeah, go ahead and subscribe and give me a like like right well like you know you're down there or whatever and yeah i post makeup vids hair vids reaction vids so if you're interested in those kind of videos go ahead and subscribe it's a great time here and i would love to have you join um yeah so let's just hop into the video TJ Maxx. TJ Maxx. let's see I'm just gonna be honest that was not a really good start to the song but it could progress from there it just didn't sound like it's just kind of shaky like she didn't start off on the right note but okay let's just continue let's continue but I will give her props for like the face, like she was serving face while she was singing it, so she's like, you know, confident with it. Uh, I like the arrangement so far, though. Oh, she's good. Okay. She's way better in this part, okay. Her voice. Her voice is beautiful, and I believe that is... Okay, I might, I might say it wrong, sorry. But y'all were commenting on the other videos because you guys are amazing, by the way. Like, you guys really came through with the little synopsis of, like, who's who and all that. That is Jisoo, J, the one J-I-S-O-O. -O. I don't know if it's Jisoo or... I don't know how else to pronounce it, Jisoo. Her, her voice, beautiful. It's like butter. It's like velvet. It's, it's gorgeous. And... Not about the vocals, but her hair, that purple hair, beautiful. Oh my gosh. Beautiful. Beautiful. Her as well. Those were the two that I got mixed up. And I don't remember which video it is now, but in that, 
in the video that I reacted to, I was like, oh, is this the same person? But they're definitely not the same person. Their tones, completely different. Completely different timbres. Like, totally different voices. Both beautiful voices. And I love the, this is so corny, but I love the fact that they're saying that instead of that. Like, they know what they're doing. Like, you gotta add that swag to it. You can't be like, whatever, that. Like, you gotta be like, that. You know? You know. If you know, you know. Her voice is so beautiful. Uh, some of you guys also, some of you guys were commenting that she, or no, am I wrong? No, you guys weren't saying that. I was about to say you guys were saying that she was the main vocalist, but I think you guys said, I don't remember the name of the other girl, but she had the red, she had red hair in the videos that I watched before. I don't remember her name, but you guys said the girl with the red hair was the main vocalist, I believe, but she's like also one of like, Ooh, like one of the main vocalists too, I guess. Her voice is beautiful. Oh my god. I can listen to just her singing this song. Like, oh, her voice is beautiful. bangs like it, she wasn't just like rapping now or whatever but the girl with the bangs like the swag and the way she delivers like the way she delivers whatever she says it's just like mm, like it has that mm to it I really like her she may be my fave Loki yeah she's like She's gesturing. Okay. Like, I gotta, I'm gonna rewind her part. Like, girl with the bags, she just, the girl. I wish I just knew their names so I could just be like concise with it. I'm sorry. But the girl who first started singing, who was also like rapping, it was like rocky in the beginning. But as she like went, as the song went on, it got a little bit better. But like, there's a clear difference between the way the girl with the bangs raps and the way the girl in the beginning rapped. Like, the girl with the bangs just like, she just executes it so well. It's just like, it makes you want to, well, it makes you want to go like, mm, girl, yes, like she, yeah, like, I don't know, like she just evokes, I don't know, she just evokes this feeling out of you when she like spits, like, good, let me rewind a little bit. She's good though too, but. made their own version while doing the cover like they made the song their own like that's not a part of the original song so like yes yes like whenever somebody's covering a song i believe that they should add their own little flair into it like it's the time where you're supposed to show your artistry instead of just like completely mimicking the other artists so my hat's off to them my hat's off to them i really love that they did that and added their own little lines in there that was nice all in all this was an amazing performance
performance. I would definitely like listen to the song again. I would add it to a playlist just for, well, the girl with the purple hair, Jisoo, if I'm saying her name right, Jisoo, her voice is like butter. It's like, oh, it's like all the gooey goodness you love about, about music. Like, oh my God, like her voice is butter. When I was reacting to those other two songs, like I was more so focusing on the girl who had the red hair in the first two songs I listened to. Jiso, girl, like she can sing, like ooh, ooh, and this is live. Like there's no hiding when something is live. That's why I almost like. That's why I almost give the girl in the beginning. I give her a pass because. When you're singing live, or even whatever, rapping live, it's hard, especially when you're the very first person in a group, to start out on the right note and set the note for the rest of it, like the rest of everyone else. So I give her a pass. Like, it's hard, like, especially when I was in chorus, it's like when you guys, or when you specifically, like, you start off with a solo, it's like, dang. I gotta find the right note. There's no instrumentation that's gonna help me find my note. I just have to be like right there. Like, so I give her a pass, especially because she completely did a 180 and it was way better as the song progressed. But I really enjoyed this. Thank you guys so much for recommending it. Also, I do wanna add, because I feel like a lot of people do this, it is way easier to criticize people than it, it, than it is to do what they're doing. So I could sit here and be like, the harmonies weren't as tight as they could be. She started out rocking. Like, I can say all that I want to say, but to be honest, like, if I was on stage, if I was her, would I be able to perform and excel? Probably not. Like, it's hard. Like, especially me, I get stage fright. Like, I get stage fright when it comes to singing on stage. So even though I'm criticizing, they're still doing the damn thing, so... Because if I was on stage, and this has happened before when I'm on stage, and it's like, mm, like you have to obviously like start the first note, and if it's like an acapella first note type of situation, where it's like the instrumentation doesn't happen first, and you are the very first pitch, it's kind of like, dang, am I going to start off on the right pitch? Like, am I going to find the pitch? Like, so yeah, all in all, like, this was really, 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 really good. And like, I love how they brought their own swag into it they didn't just do a cover like like they didn't do a cover where it's just like singing the song verbatim the same groove as Miguel which is phenomenal but I'm just saying like when you do a cover it should have your artistry on it like it needs your stamp like it shouldn't just be a copycat of the original you know what I'm saying so Thank you guys so much for recommending it again. I am going to check out the other videos you guys recommended. So if you want to see me react to those, please go ahead and subscribe and turn on the notification bell and you will be notified when I upload those videos, which will be super, 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 super soon. All right. I love you guys and I will see you in my next video. Besitos. Okay, low-key irrelevant, but not irrelevant. Like, I already watched the video and ended the video and all that, but I do want to add, I don't know if you guys saw my video on Monster X singing Drama Marama Ro. I can't even remember the name, but Drama Rama, Drama, there we go, Drama Rama. The harmonies, those boys were spewing in that song. I was like, and I think it was like the very first 30 seconds or so of the video, I was shook. Those are some tight harmonies. Cha! I was shook.